Right. Looks like it's time for plan B. Oh, right. There's a plan B, is there? It's just plan A was so brilliantly devised, I wouldn't have thought we'd need a plan B. What is it, climb over her fence? It's a bit higher than I imagined. I'm not saying don't give to charity. Do give to charity. I'm just saying you can give without supporting this egotistical vanity fest. My daughter is one of the models. Then you've failed her. <laughs> oh, I don't know how you can do this. Especially after everything Carrie's been through. <laughs> it hasn't been an easy ride for me either. <laughs> trying to stay out of her clutches. Her dad died last month. <laughs> But not. Not what? But it's not. It's not relevant, is it? What's going on? I've been told to leave for dumping a girl I wasn't going out with. Oh, fuck. Are you OK, Will? Fine, thanks. We'll be back for you in a minute. You know you're starting to flare up. Yup. Thanks, Lauren. Won't be a minute. Is that a fish? Yes, Lauren. It's a fucking fish. Give me a minute. Yes, spazzy little African babies riddled with malaria and AIDS. Oh. There they go, onto the fire, sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. But why don't we at least attempt to have a sophisticated conversation? I know it's a tall order, and I'm not expecting sparkling, but let's give it a go, eh? As if it's my fucking birthday! How much Lego can you stuff up your bum? Oh, for Christ's sake! You are banned from going inside. Why? Because you do something like steal my mum's knickers to sniff and then wank with. With? Yes, with. And then you'll take great pleasure in telling me how you wrapped my mother's knickers round your cock and used the friction generated whilst thinking about her tits to make you come. Hello, Will. Oh. Hello, Mr Cooper. How's your revision going? Yeah, not bad. Pretty good. Got an excellent schedule sorted, colour coded and balancing my time well. Got some drinks here to help, Pro Plus, that sort of thing. Right. And nothing's fucking going in. Nothing. I mean, look at this. I must have read about the accountability of legislatures to citizens 50 times, and I still don't know what it means. I'm starting to doubt if legislatures is even a word. Boring. So what? If I eat this bonsai tree, I automatically become fun and interesting, do I? Yes. Fine. Well, I'll eat it then, and we'll see. Go on, then. I will. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm going to bed, so can you try and keep it down, yeah? What the fuck have you done? Hi, Will. Fancy a sausage? Calm down, I just got it going. I didn't even need a fire gaze badge. No, just some petrol. You put petrol on it? Wait a minute. Is that my fold-up table on the fire? And my picnic basket? I thought you said look for stuff to burn. What? Burn fucking wood, not my stuff! On holiday in Spain one year, me and my mate took a pedlo out and we went to Africa. Do you think you could spare us the bullshit for one minute while I try to figure out how not to die at sea? The puff on your first joint doesn't make you Kurt Cobain. Look, if you want to be a mummy's boy, that's fine. But stop trying to bring us down, man. Am I a mummy's boy because I refuse to bow to peer pressure? Or am I, in fact, the opposite? You're a mummy's boy. Come on, pal. Have a puff. Show us you're not scared. Well, I would, but I don't actually smoke because... Oh, what's that thing you get when you smoke? Sex? No, cancer, Neil. How did you get in? Well, front door was open. Neil, did you leave the front door open? No, I don't. I'll do us some toast, Neil. All right. Sorry, is there a sign outside by the permanently open front door saying this way to the toast bar? Look, you're not even watching the TV. All right, calm down home alone. It's just force of habit. Why are you even here? Oh, I need to get away from my place. The dog's driving me fucking mad. Because it stares at you while you masturbate. Is this a joke? Do I make a lot of jokes? But, sir... I can't change the placements. Can't or won't? You pick. It's the same result. You are all right with me seeing Lauren later, aren't you? Yeah, of course. She's pretty cool, actually. You see? Fuck! Oh, you don't pay the eyed little sticks! I put a lot of effort into this. I made a really nice cock o van. Cock of what? Oh, you don't help yourself, do you? Oh, yes, I see. Cock o van, very mature. It actually means chicken in wine, doesn't it, Patrice? What? Well, it does. And it doesn't mean cock up my ass or. Cock on my head, or you've got some cock in the back of a van, or that I got a cock in the back of a van. Go away. Fine, fine. That's the last you see of me. Oh fuck off, then. You don't believe in song lines any more than I do. It's just a way for you to seem interesting to girls because deep down you know you're boring and pretentious, just like your stupid fucking dreadlocks. Which, by the way, always look embarrassing on white people. They're not countercultural. They actually scream, "Oh, I've got a trust fund." So get a normal haircut. You unbearable prick. What's he gonna knock up? A closet for you to hide in, you bum -da?